Shots fired from the heart of Donald Trump's inner circle on Thursday as the president's new communications director, Anthony Scaramucci, laid into senior White House staff in a New Yorker article laced with profanity. A key target of his verbal attack, Trump's chief of staff, Reince Priebus, who officials say tried to block Scaramucci from getting a job in the White House. Scaramucci calling him a f paranoid schizophrenic and saying he suspects Priebus of leaking information. The chief of staff hasn't responded, but his close friend, Speaker of the House Paul Ryan, was asked about the feud earlier that day. If those two gentlemen have differences, my advice would be to sit down and settle your differences. Ryan is doing a fantastic job at the White House, and I believe he has the president's confidence. But not everyone shares that view, and Scaramucci's scathing remarks are expected to fuel speculation that Priebus could be on his way out, because Trump hasn't had any major legislative wins, in his first six months in office. Also in the crosshairs in Thursday's article, Steve Bannon, Scaramucci slamming Trump's chief strategist for wanting too much media attention and trying to build his own brand, quote, off the f***ing strength of the president. Once the article was published, Scaramucci tweeted he may be prone to colorful language, but he wouldn't give up the fight for Trump's agenda. He also took a pop at Ryan Lizza, the journalist who wrote the article based on a phone call with Scaramucci the day before, tweeting, I made a mistake in trusting a reporter. It won't happen again.